Hi Leo, how are you? I hope you are well. I hope you're fine. I hope you're safe wherever you are right now. This reading for today is for the Leo friends out there. This is a weekly reading for Leo. This is for the second week of March 2021. This is a love reading, okay? What is the message for Leo? What can I get for Leo, please? What is the message, okay? Before I start, Leo, I would like to thank you for coming back. Thank you so much for tuning in. Thanks for being here today. Guest viewers, if you haven't clicked the subscribe button in the bell, please do it now if you are interested and if you are keen. And if you would like to further support my channel, check out the description box below Leo because in there, you'll find the details of my Instagram account. Connect with me there, please. Check out the website in the website as well, www.sunshine-tv.com. In there, you will find the manifestation shop. All of the items, it comes with a free shipping worldwide. It comes also with a free tarot reading session for me. So type your question, type your manifestation, and I will get back to you with your free private reading, okay? And also, Leo, if you're interested in it, if you have time, I recommend you to check out the website. We have put an entry there about how to accept love. It is a very interesting read. And we also uploaded um, uh, an astrological update about Mars going to Gemini. Um, if you want to know how it's going to impact your sign in love and in general, have a look at it, guys. It's in the website. It is um, a three to four minutes read, okay? So in today's reading, Leo, I will be looking at the past situation, past energy for you. And then I will be looking at the blockages. I'm going to go through the current energy, your person's energy, the mutual energy between the two of you. And then I'm going to be looking at the future of this connection, predictive outcome and advice. Depending on the message that I will pick up for today, I will let you know if there's a need to extend the reading. I will also let you know if there is a new love, a new love opportunity in here, okay? <laughs> All right, so let's start your reading, Leo. You started off with the Knight of Pentacles in upright position and the Lover's card in reverse, okay? It could be a Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, a Knight of Pentacles. This is a slow moving offer. And it came, all right? So I'm really getting the word, I'm hearing the word, they came. There was a solid offer coming from someone. There was someone in the past who connected. It's possible that this is a very recent or it could be current. But whatever it is that you want, it came. It came from someone you, someone you broke your heart. Someone who disappointed you in the past. This is an ex-lover, okay? Okay. The lover's card in reverse. I mean, you've been wanting for this person in in you know, um, in the in 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 the past, maybe sometime sometime around January month or sometime of last year or further to that, um, you were in love with this person. You know, at some point you were in love with them. Uh, your head over heels in love with them. You are in a relationship with them. But you break up, you separated. If it's a dating scenario, this is a person where you, you know, you fell in love. It, it could be your first love, but there is a first love. There is a loving moment between the two of you. Something happened. It got destroyed for some of you by a third party. For some of you, it was a mutual decision to separate. For some of you, it was a dating situation. It was more than friends, but less than the lovers and you gave up, you know. This is a person who broke your heart, who disappointed you, or for some of you, it's still feeling unknown, like more than friends, but less than lovers, okay? Something is not too pronounced yet between the two of you. The Knight of Pentacles is here. Um, it is a slow moving offer, but it is solid, okay? There's something with the Knight of Pentacles that you took a risk, three of wands, the five of swords. It could be... This is still happening up until now because this is the past energy, past situation. Moving to the current, whoever this is that came back, connected, reconnected, or for some of you guys, you're still waiting. You've got a future from this person. This person, Five of Swords, they bring you a change, okay? In the past, they disappointed you big time. In the past, they were moving slow from past to per 
from past to present, you know, this person is still in the Knight of Pentacles. They don't actually, um, you know, they don't mind the time. You know, this person is only focused on one thing, you know. This person is focused on one thing, Leo, to deliver. Uh, regardless of how, because you're in a, you have a plan. Leo is about action, passion, and fire. You're dealing with a person who is, it's not about the timing, it's about the feeling, okay? Uh, Knight of Pentacles, the lover's card, the three of wands. You know exactly what you want with this person. Queen of, you know, you're the, in the current energy, you are the queen of, queen of wands in reverse, the ten of pentacles, okay? Right now, you're kind of waiting for this person to express the ten of pentacles and the queen of wands, okay? But up until now, this person is still out there, slow moving, slowly approaching. Um, it's still not so... There is an element coming in your current energy, Leo. You know exactly what you want from this person. You want to date them for a short period of time and then be exclusive. Okay? That's that's for sure. Okay? Because Queen of Wands, you know, this is, okay, we're going to be friends. And then we should be lovers because we have already invested something in the past. But these two cards is in reverse because... The person that you're dealing with, it's freaking slow. Look at them. One. How many, you know, they, it, they're they slowly, it's slow, sure, steady. Whereas in your case, you are, you don't know whether you wait, you will wait for them. You don't know if, where are they? You know, what's the status? What's the status? Because the hangman in upright position, the strength card, which is your card, you don't know how long you should wait, okay? You know that this person is somewhere out there, three of wands. You're waiting for them. You know that they've got something good, something nice. You know that they're changing. Something good is happening with your person and yourself. But you don't like the process of Knight of Pentacles going through you. It's quite boring, you know? You are... In, in this reading, Leo, you're coming across as, you know what I want, and you don't want to prolong the ceremony. Your person is in a ceremony. Tan, 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 tan. You know, they would walk from here up until they reach you. You, on the other hand, Leo, if this is a wedding ceremony, the wedding march, you wouldn't wait for your person to reach the altar. You would run, meet them halfway, and pull them. To speed up, okay? You're dealing with a person who's steady, who's easy, who for some of you, while they connect, reconnect with you, or while you're in their relationship, they would like to display to you, Leo, that they've changed. So they would like to romanticize you. They would like to... This is a person that you're dealing with where um, for them, the right thing to do is to... Knight of Pentacles, to do it in ceremony. To do it in baby step, step one, step two, step three, onto the cha cha, onto the music. You, you on the other hand, you are decided. Your person, they are decided, but they've got a schedule. So if they if they start dating you in Jen, they wanna be with you in May. So they have a timeline. They have a couple of roadblocks that they would, um, they would come across. For some of you, it's because of distance. For some of you, I see this person. They have an ex-lover they're trying to get rid with. Five of swords, they want to heal. But what's strong in your reading is that you know what you want. You know what will you do with this person when they come back. And at some point as well, you, Leo, have a limitation. Because you cannot wait forever. You know, you're trying to give the patient, you're giving them time, but you're not going to wait forever. Okay, you're not going to wait forever with this person. This person is in the process of going to you from past to the current. They're quite behind. They're quite behind. And even and as you move on to the future of this connection, you've got the chariot card in reverse. Very slow moving person. Six of cups. 
it could be an ex where you had a long-term relationship with or it could be a person where you dated them um, for a short period of time or it could be on and off um there's something quite unique between the two of you that it is hard to forget and at some point you are comparing why could you not um why why it is difficult for you to move on or why it is difficult for you to forget this person because you've got a six of cups moment six of cups moment this is soulmate this is deep okay even though you did not reach that exclusivity is something deep rooted in your connection even though you guys separated they're still holding a big part of your life good good memories so in the future in the predictive outcome and in the future they are around but they're very slow the page of swords the three of pentacles finally they will reach a point of three of pentacles the most awaited moment they will reach that i'm seeing this around september october and then if it's not successful, I'm seeing them come back January of next year. If it's not successful, I think you would move on. Between now up until the date that I told you, be open to other opportunities. Um, I know you have a strong cosmic ties with this person, but don't forget other opportunities. You have a lot of soulmate, by the way. So it is scheduled to happen. It is there. It's a slow moving night. It's sure. You know, it's a slow moving night, okay? The approach of this person is slow and steady. It will reach a point of culmination. Your person in the immediate future will reach a point of I'm ready. But the question is, are you ready? Or you might be dating another person, okay? So again, this is predictive. It is all up to you if you will be open to them. It is predictive, intuitive, tarot reading, it gives you an insight on, you know, whatever I could channel intuitively. And it's up to you on your decision. But this is so... Look at that. Look at the journey of your person. It is quite a, you know, a long, a long journey. In here, in the current, you already know what to do with this person. Okay? Your person is quite behind. They will reach a three of pentacles moment already. Your, your person will be ready to give you the effort that you want but i'm not sure whether you're available for that or you're still interested with that because in the current energy you've got your leo card the strength card you're about to give up or you're about to you know like move on or you're about to look at other opportunities i say okay so this is Yulia. Thank you so much for tuning in. Thanks for being here today. I hope you liked the reading. If you do, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell. And I'll see you soon again, guys. Bye-bye.